Hey there, friends. It's Pharmacist Michael. Let me hit you with a wild idea. What if I told you there's a painkiller made by your own body? That's right. Imagine a compound so effective, it's shown in studies to significantly reduce chronic pain without causing drowsiness, dependency, or stomach damage. No opiates, no NSAIDs, no harsh side effects. Welcome to the world of palmitol ethanolamide, or PEA for short, a fatty molecule you've probably never heard of, but that may change the way we approach pain forever. Palmitol ethanolamide is a naturally occurring fatty acid amide. Your body makes it as part of your internal response to inflammation and pain. It's also found in small amounts in foods like egg yolks, soy, and peanuts. But here's the kicker. When taken as a supplement in the right form, PEA can do some pretty amazing things. You see, PEA isn't just floating around randomly. It's a precision molecule. It acts at the root of inflammation, modulating the cells involved in pain signaling. That includes mast cells, glial cells, and immune cells, all major players in chronic pain syndromes. Here's where things get cool. PEA activates something called PPAR-alpha, a receptor that plays a central role in regulating inflammation, cellular metabolism, and pain perception. But it doesn't stop there. PEA also downregulates mast cell activity, which are often overactive in inflammatory conditions, and it calms overexcited glial cells in the nervous system which are known to amplify chronic pain signals in conditions like sciatica, fibromyalgia, or neuropathy. So instead of just masking pain like many drugs do, PEA helps to rebalance your body's pain processing pathways. It's like turning down the static on a radio that's been blasting discomfort 24-7. Now, you know I don't hype supplements without data. So let's talk science. Multiple systematic reviews and meta-analyses, yes, the gold standard of medical evidence, have shown that micronized or ultra-micronized PEA can significantly reduce pain intensity in a variety of chronic and neuropathic pain conditions. And I'm not talking tiny improvements here. Some studies show 35% to 70% reductions in pain scores over 60 days. In fact, in some trials, PEA performed better than placebo or standard therapies, with no meaningful side effects. That's huge, especially in a world where side effects from NSAIDs, gabapentin, and opiates are all too common. So, what types of pain are we talking about here? Well, research shows PEA may be helpful for sciatic nerve pain, fibromyalgia, diabetic neuropathy, temporal mandibular joint or TMJ disorders, osteoarthritis, post-surgical pain, multiple sclerosis-related pain, and endometriosis. And what's really exciting is PEA is being explored as an adjunct, meaning it can be added to other treatments to improve outcomes without stacking up the side effects. So, if you're considering trying PEA, here's what you need to know. Most studies use 300 to 600 milligrams taken once or twice daily. Some chronic conditions benefit more with a longer duration. We're talking 60 days or more. Go for micronized or ultra-micronized PEA. This means it's broken into smaller particles to improve absorption and bioavailability. Regular PEA? Not nearly as effective. And here's the beauty of PEA. It has one of the best safety profiles I've seen in pain management. 
No major side effects reported in studies up to 60 days. No sedation, no tolerance, no dependence. Compare that to NSAIDs, opiates, or even gabapentinoids, and it's not even close. I have placed a link to the PEA supplement I recommend in the description section of this video for your convenience. As always, not every supplement is right for every person. If you're pregnant or breastfeeding, skip it. There's not enough safety data. If you're already taking a cocktail of medications, especially for pain or inflammation, talk to your pharmacist or physician before adding PEA to the mix. That said, for many people looking to reduce their reliance on prescription meds, especially opiates or NSAIDs, this could be a very attractive option. Now, one of the most exciting parts about PEA is how well it stacks with other natural anti-inflammatories. Try pairing it with luteolin for added neuroinflammation support, curcumin to boost systemic anti-inflammatory action, omega-3 fatty acids, especially for brain and joint synergy, and CBD for patients looking for holistic, plant-based pain relief. I've seen some impressive case reports and anecdotal feedback from people using these stacks with great success, especially in long-standing pain syndromes. So let's wrap this up. PEA is a naturally occurring molecule your body makes to fight pain and inflammation. It has strong clinical evidence, especially in neuropathic and chronic pain conditions. It's well-tolerated, non-sedating, and non-addictive, and it may offer hope for millions of people seeking alternatives to harsh medications. But like any supplement, it's not a miracle. Think of it as part of a bigger toolbox. nutrition movement, mindset, and yes, sometimes medication. Still, if you or someone you love is living with chronic pain, PEA might just be worth a serious conversation with your healthcare provider. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more pharmacist-approved health tips. Drop a comment below if you've tried PEA or have questions. I'd love to hear your story. And as always, be happy and be healthy. My name is Pharmacist Michael, and I'll see you in the next video.